Got this Equinox 800 back out here, and we're going to look at this ground balance on this machine a little bit and see what some of its tendencies are. I uh, see a gentleman on the farm who's got a new Vanquish, I guess, and he thinks it might have something wrong with it, and I guess he's got a buddy with an Equinox 800 that may be doing what it's doing. But I think he lives out in higher mineralized soil area than I do, but anyway, this is medium mineralized ground, and I'm in field two. I've got all the segments accepted, okay? And we're gonna go down here. I'm at 24 sensitivity, if that makes any difference. And I'm gonna ground balance this machine. Auto ground balance. You see the number of windows, 44. Now, if I swiftly let the coil down to the ground, and I've listened to this with headphones on, zero feedback. With an auto ground balance. Now, if I mash the horseshoe button, I get feedback. And you see that number in the window there. It's minus eight, but it's low reporting feedback, okay, from the ground. Now, if I go in here and let this ground balance down to zero, which is the default setting, okay, and repeat this, I get more feedback. You still see the minus eight in the window, but the feedback is is more feedback, okay? So again, machine's ground balanced. Just a little feedback. Now, if I go in here to the ground balance, and I'm gonna leave it in the ground balance menu. We're going all the way to 99, okay? Now listen. See what happens when I bring the coil off the ground? Hear that? So I'm gonna leave that menu open. See the feedback is starting to lessen. When I get down near the range of auto ground balance, then I get about what I get when I do the auto ground balance, okay? So I don't know what this guy's are saying. He's a saying his machine is a beeping when he brings the call down, I guess. But this is a multi-frequency machine and the ground balance is not, it's a little different than a single frequency machine, I believe. So I don't know exactly what he's seeing. And I've looked at a lot of modes on this machine and they all seem to act very similar, okay? The only thing I can say is there's part one. Now if we go to it, one thing I noticed, okay, we'll do the ground balance. Okay. Now, horseshoe engaged. When I come down on the ground, in it, I don't get any feedback. And notice the meter doesn't flash up an iron number, okay? Like a negative eight or whatever. Okay. In part two, see, I get that again. See it? It's like, now there's field one. Let's see what I've got for a ground balance here. Okay, she's ground balanced. Field one, I don't get any feedback. Now, I've listened to this using this headphones and WMO8 module to make sure, you know, because being outside, I might not be a hearing it through the external speaker, but I've listened. No feedback. Field one. In part one, but field two, part two, prospecting mode to give feedback too. I didn't check the beach modes. We'll get it ground ballast here. Okay. So now there's prospecting one. I guess I better get out of 40 kilohertz. There we go. Hear it? So you get some feedback in prospect. Actually, you probably get more feedback in prospect in one than you do in field two or part two. So would it be interesting to see what this gentleman comes up with? I think he sent his uh, vanquish unit into mine lab, thinking maybe the ground balance is not correct on it. So we'll see.